I am going to show you how to use the, uh, the spline wrap tool. Okay, um, here we see an image of, um, of me and my wife, and I'm going to make her eye, um, I said, um, a little more bigger or smaller doing that. So the first thing in here I want to do is I'm going to select my uh, read note here and I'm going to hit tab and I'm going to type in spline wrap tool doing that. And as soon as I do that, uh, it automatically highlights the, uh, uh, the read plane and then also it chooses, it also highlights the, uh, the Bezier tool right away. So what I want to do is I'm going to Go around the eye, best around the eye, the best I can. So click here, click here, a little bigger, click here, and I'm trying to make these line up the best I can. Like this, like that, and I'm going to select this. If hit the Z, it smooths out the curve. Like that, and then the same thing here, it smooth out. <laughs> Like that. Okay. Oops. Okay. My fingers a little twitchy this morning. All right. There we go. And then I want to select the Bessier tool again, and this is where it will be stretched from or bulged from. So I'm trying to line up the best I can with these. So here. Here. Okay. Like this. Okay. And now I'll select the uh, the join tool. Just like this. And I can click this here. And here. And as soon as I do that, boop, the eyes is bigger. Do that. So now I can um, go into my transform area. I can, oops, let me make sure I select that. I can move around if I want to. So as you can see, I'm like, I see you, I know what you're doing, doing that. So, oh, yeah, all right. So, and also you, you can animate this as well, doing that. So if we go in here, um, to just right click, oops, sure, there we go. You want, there we go, you know, right click, oops. Here, you can see in the animation set already. So if I move this, doing that, so it didn't hear maybe like this. Yeah, look back again. Maybe it looks up. Yeah, I see a balloon up there. Doing that. Wait, then you maybe like say maybe I see a uh, squirrel down there. All right, rewind, and then go back in here. And see how this looks like. Everyone and play. It's squirrel. <laughs> well, well, that's it. Um, that's how I use the spline wrap tool. Thank you so very much, and have a wonderful day.